Hi there, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Trash Talk on the Matt Brown Show. Today, we're going to talk some trash about business, specifically this here news development. Sony buys Destiny game developer Bungie for $3.6 billion. There's lots of acquisition movement happening in the games industry. Sony was one of those deals. The next one was this one by Microsoft, who buys Activision Blizzard for a whopping 687 dollars billion dollars now if you haven't heard microsoft acquisition of activision gives them essentially ownership of call of duty huge sony huge huge sony playstation uh, game i love it personally and just to put this in perspective this is the largest technology acquisition deal in history in the u.s so here's the thing with this right why is microsoft acquiring activision blizzard for 68.7 billion if Call of Duty is already cross-console, so Mm. it's on Xbox, it's on, I don't know, PlayStation, it's on PC. It's a lot of money to be dropping uh, on, uh, you know, (laughs) a Call of Duty and Candy Crush. (laughs) Candy Crush. Do they play that on Facebook still? Do they make that? God, Candy Crush was a thing, like, in social gaming. Remember that whole thing? Yeah. Yeah, so like, what is going on here, guys? Why is Microsoft, why, why is Microsoft buying Activision Blizzard? Well, if you think about it, it doesn't really make a lot of sense on the face of it. Here's why. Um, The story with Activision is that they were already embroiled in quite a bit of turmoil, apparently unequal pay, whole bunch of misconduct uh, cases or allegations of misconduct. And here you go, you've got Microsoft's uh, you know, C- uh, CEO Satya Nadella coming in and saying, hey, the culture of our organization is our number one priority. And it's critical for Activision Blizzard to drive forward on its commitments to improve workplace culture. So now I know that culture is really what makes a business. Right, And if you look further at the Blizzard share price over the last year, it hasn't exactly been heading north. In fact, if anything, it's been stable and or heading into the decline. In fact, it's only rallied post the news of the acquisition. Otherwise, over the last year, you can clearly see the stock prices on the decline. So you've got a company that's dwindling in valuation. You've got a toxic culture, allegations of unequal pay. Uh, and, and, and. So why, why, why do you buy Activision? In fact, this is crazy. The biggest technology acquisition in the US in history. In history, people, this makes no sense. It makes no sense. Except when you think about the fact that what if you pulled Call of Duty off PlayStation consoles? Whoa. Big news. Big news. What they, would that mean? They promised they won't, though. What? Yeah. Did they? Yeah. How do you know that? Well, they've said that they won't, but I mean... Yeah, I also say I'm going to do a lot of things <laughs> <laughs> that don't become a reality. Yeah. Okay? Call of Duty. God, what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. Peace. Peace.